Hello again, human beings from the planet Earth. I wanted to uh, touch base with you on this deal. You know, many of you uh, probably think that the uh, BP oil spill is over, the golf thing, you know, that's pretty much a cleaned up, everything is fine. It's probably outside of your thinking because we got kids shooting kids and we got all this other mayhem going on and, you know, it's so hard to keep up with yesterday's news and make people realize that it's still going along today. But thanks to this report from E&E &E News, uh, thousands suffering from chronic problems. Uh, that's thousands dying, okay? Even this is a watered down, it, they're dying uh, because of the BP oil spill. And, uh, you know, you can go ahead and read this. Uh, you may have noticed that I'm not big on, on reading stuff to you. Um, and it's not because I'm lazy, it's not because you don't deserve the information, it's because I don't want to be the mainstream. I, I don't want to spoon feed you. I, I don't want you to just take my word for it. I want you to go read it yourself. I want you to get active because there can't be just a few of us doing this, folks. Okay? You, we all need to get up. We need to do something. And it starts with your own research and your own reading so that you can be sure of your decisions, not guided by something that sounds good. I'm not Alex Jones, nor will I ever be like him. Uh, I'm not going to feed you what I think you need to know. I'm, I'm going to give you information. I'm going to point you in a direction. I'm going to kick you in the ass and make you go yourself. It's what we all should be doing. Um, and you'll skim through this and see that people are sick and dying in the Gulf. And now, many of you may not know, and I, I don't have a link in front of me, um, but I did see, uh, maybe it was close to a year ago now, that there are plans to put one of the biggest oil refinery complexes uh, known down there in the Gulf states. And this may very well have been part of that plan uh, to drive people out of the area so that, you know, it would be a lot cheaper to put this oil refinery in uh, in the Gulf. So you, if you're interested in that, you can do more research to that effect. Um, but in the meantime, you know, how do we stop things like this? Well, quite honestly, uh, this lies in the lap of all of us. I mean, what have we done to stop our oil consumption? Our, our need for it. I mean, they're going to keep drilling and uh, drilling and drilling and drilling because we're going to keep using it. So we got to think about that as individuals. Um, you know, do we take the car to the store all the time or do we walk now and then? Or, uh, you know, when we see uh, that somebody is going in the same direction we are on a regular basis, do we reach out to them and say, hey, can we get together and share uh, a ride? Or, or what are we doing? Uh, this is uh, part of our responsibility too and we want to bitch about the government and what they're doing and the reason they're doing it is because we're letting them uh, we're letting them and and quite honestly we want them to we want the oil we want the big trucks we want all this bullshit and so anyway now I'm babbling uh, anyway there's the, the link will be below so you can read this for yourself but um, people still dying in the Gulf because of uh, big oil much love, many thanks, and I'll see you soon.